welcome back i'm glad you're here this uh, unboxing battle was effectively a tie so i have chosen the winner randomly and uh, it turned out to be call of obsidian so i hope you enjoy and you are in for a treat this figure is part of a new format which i'm working on about movie themed battles i'll try to include as much characters as possible since not all of them are featured on action figures. The ones with Lux are yet to be unboxed, reviewed, and posed. This first movie theme battle is called Thanos Decimates Asgard. The title is uh, self-explanatory. Enjoy. All right, welcome back again. You submitted your votes but unfortunately, it was a draw, a tie. So for this unboxing battle, I generated the winner randomly with a tool, and it turns out to be Cold Obsidian. So Ebony Mao can wait for the next one. These figures are from the Infamous line. This figure is huge, I mean. This is the one we're going to take a look at now. It's called Dark Star. <laughs> its real name is Cole Obsidian. And this one, it says Space Wizard. So <laughs> I joke about it. So yeah, now it's the biggest figure so far. I have a Hulk and I have Thanos as well. And this one is taller than both of them. So. Uh, something worth mentioning as well, other than the branding, is that these figures, uh, the price is a bit high compared to the quality, but totally worth it, at least, uh, from the reviews that I have seen from my, pair, my peers. These guys, the children of Thanos, uh, those guys, they are called in Marvel. Um, the black border so we're not just going to take a look at uh, Call of City and Ebony Mall but also the other ones including uh, both uh, Thanos daughters and let's see I think we're gonna have uh, fun unboxing it so without further ado, let's take a look at it. All right, so let's unbox Curl of Syrian. This it's a huge figure, as I said. Now let's try something. Dun, 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 dun. Told you. Told you this figure was huge. Let's do the honors first. And this is These are half the size of my hand. Well, Third, so really nice.
I'm not sure if this is particular to my uh, item, but it looks like the hips, the joints there, are not as strong as uh, the other figures. So, so. Okay. And here's the hammer, or whatever we want to call it. So there's no base for this guy. This does not have moving parts. It's in, you know, fit for my... Really cool. So, let's change this.
<laughs> and this is a massive figure and really cool too so I hope you enjoyed this unboxing rather quick but definitely we can't have the whole uh, Thanos children without the biggest one so I think uh, they exaggerated a little bit in his size because he's that not you know he's not that big just a little bit over Thanos but not that big but anyways I really like it and also the hammer it's big and heavy as well so you'll have a little bit of trouble with the knees and also the, the you know the joints are good the paint looks good as well so these are infamous figures they are not you know they are the competition of hot toys and, and other uh, houses that create high-end uh, figures this one's uh, $300 or something so the price is right for you know given how big this figure is and also how awesome it looks so I'm digging it looks really nice in the collection so next up it will be Ebony Mo and I'm gonna show you guys him with him I'll try to make the same pose as well so anyways thank you for watching like it like the video if you like it like it like it and uh, subscribe if you, if you still haven't I would appreciate it a lot and uh, it helps me you know by I don't know, making the channel grow. But this is just the the hobby that we all like. So I really hope you enjoy it and uh, that after you saw this video, you can make your mind, make up your mind on whether to buy it or not. So again, thank you so much. And as always, see you on the next one.